Hey, what's up guys? Foodless is back and today I'm making braided cinnamon raisin bread with bourbon soap, jumbo raisins, buttery cinnamon brown sugar, and at the end I might even have a special little addition. Stick around, I'll show you how. We have two cups of bread flour in our stand mixer. This is one package of instant yeast, one half teaspoon of salt, quarter cup of sugar. Give those dry ingredients a quick little mix. This is three quarters of a cup of reduced fat milk heated to 120 degrees. In most of my doughs, the liquid is heated to 110. That's because I'm using active dry yeast. In this case, I'm using instant dry yeast. We're gonna bring the temperature up closer to 120. This is three tablespoons of vegetable oil. One whole egg, and I'll mix this on medium for about two minutes. You might have to adjust the flour just a touch if it's a little too loose. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy a little kitchen content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We'll put out a weekly video. Come on by, check us out whenever you like. I have some bourbon soaked jumbo raisins here. It's a mixture of brown raisins and golden raisins. It's really gonna add a nice flavor to this bread. I'm gonna strain these because I need to be careful of the liquid, so I wanna take out as much of that excess liquid as possible. And we'll add our raisins into our dough. We've turned the dough out onto our work surface, and I wanna let you know that I added about an additional quarter cup of flour during the mixing process. Now we're gonna knead this for about two minutes. Cover it, we'll let it rest for about 10 or 15 minutes. In this little mixing bowl, I'm gonna add a half a cup of brown sugar and a tablespoon of cinnamon. Just a little shake of some nutmeg. I'm gonna make a glaze for this bread. It's gonna be like a donut glaze, but instead of using water or milk, I'm gonna use a splash of this bourbon. It's one cup of powdered sugar in the bowl and about two tablespoons of bourbon. That's about what we want. We'll put it on with a little pastry brush. Now that our dough has had a nice little rest, I'm gonna roll this out into a rectangle. That way we can cut three strips and we can make our braids. We'll spread some soft butter down the center of each of these strips. Now a layer of cinnamon sugar down the center. We'll fold these up, pinch them closed, and seal them. We transfer these onto a parchment lined sheet pan and we're just gonna braid these. I've tried to tuck in these edges as best as I can. Now we're just gonna cover this with a towel. We're gonna let it rise for about an hour and a half. Now we'll give this guy a little egg wash with an egg yolk and a little bit of water. We'll pop it in a 385 degree oven for about 20 to 25 minutes. 